how to track time for multiple users on the same item in monday.com. Now, this is a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to actually do this. So yeah, let's get started. Well, it is actually super easy to do, but the very first thing is how do you actually track time? Well, um, you want to make sure to add a new column. So if you click on add column right over there, um, you can see all the columns over here, but it probably won't show up in there because you have to click on more columns. Now here you can see all of these columns and what you basically want to do is simply search for track right over here. And now at the bottom, you can see the time tracking column. Now you want to add this to your board right over there, just like that. Now I can simply track the time just like that. And then um, also for this uh, item right over there. And now I'm currently tracking the time. Now how to actually do this for multiple people or, tra or track it for different types of people. Well, that's actually super easy to do. All you basically want to do is make sure that there actually are multiple people inside your board. And once they are, all you want to do is simply assign multiple different people to a singular task. Now, once you've done that, um, when that when I, for example, click on track, um, I will track it for myself. But when uh, someone else on their account will click on track, it will also track it for their selves. Once you click on here, you can see uh, the different sessions. You can see it also for different people when they have uh, tracked their time. Now here you can see the total time and then here you can see it per person, which is pretty nice. Now you can also clear it or actually export it to Excel, which is pretty nice. Now that's actually how you can do it, but how does this work for sub items? Well, over here, I have a bunch of sub items and let's say um, these are also for multiple people or um, this one is assigned to someone else and this one is also assigned to someone else and this one is assigned to me. Then simply just add a column, then more columns, um, search for track, add it to the board. And then here, the same time tracking uh, works the exact same like it does in here. Um, but when, when I collapse it, um, you can actually see that the total of time is not showing up over here. So let's say I would track a couple of seconds and I will just uh, clear this one real quick. Then once I have tracked a couple of seconds, then what you can do is simply click on the three dots over here and then click on show summary on parent item. Now, um, here you can actually see the summary of all of the tracking right over here and you can see it for each sub and then you can also see the detailed uh, tracking right over there and then you can also see all of the different sessions so this, this is the total of time well currently it says zero hours and zero minutes uh, but that's because i've only uh, tracked a couple of seconds and not minutes yet so yeah that is basically it. I hope this video helped you out. Let me know in the comments if it did. And then I will see you next time.